Hey guys, today's video is going to be a simple, cute Christmas look to get into the festive season because I've already got not one, not two, but three Christmas trees up. This is only one and then I have two more out in my living room, like my large and my small tree. And then I have my vanity decorated with garland and lights and bulbs. But today's look is going to be... Like I said, very simple. I'm gonna do like an, a white eyeshadow look and then a giant snowflake on one eye and then just my regular base and a bright red lip because I love red lips with white for Christmas and that's what we're gonna do. So let's get into it. I'm gonna start my face off priming with the e.l.f. Luminous Putty Primer. And then I will be going in using the Wet n Wild Tinted Hydrator with my L'Oreal Lo Lotion. And then my concealer will be the Wet n Wild Incognito. I low-key think this concealer smells like pumpkin. I don't know. That's the best way to describe it. I applied the concealer in basically my T-zone. And then here I'm just blending out with my small concealer beauty blender. And then here I'm just applying my L'Oreal Glotion and then my Wet n Wild Tinted Hydrator. And then I blended it out also with a beauty blender as well. And all of my beauty blenders and my brushes are dirty. I do need to clean them. Don't come for me. Going in with my Rare Beauty bronzer stick, I put this on my cheekbones, my forehead, and my jawline. And then I almost always use a brush to blend that out, and I apply powder products with the same brush. I'm gonna go in with blush. This is Miss Claus, Santa's daughter. Is here to slay, bad and bougie, on this brush, the Harry Potter makeup brush. And I just mix these three shades together. So this one, this one, this one. I wanted this look very rosy since it is the start of my winter content. Florida doesn't get super cold, but I wanted to look very chilly, cold makeup. And I always scrunch my nose when I apply blush. I think it just helps me apply better and it looks funny. <laughs> I go in with my foundation beauty blender to make sure the blush isn't too harsh. And then highlighter. I'm just gonna go in with this palette. And my highlighter brush from Moda Pro. Yeah. And I'm gonna go in with these two shades. Can we talk about how blinding this highlight is? I'm obsessed with this palette, and if you don't have it yet, you should definitely check it out. This is like my cleanest brush. It has white on it, because I use it for paint. <laughs> but it's not like hardened. The bristles are still not stiff, so like I'm gonna use this for the eyeshadow. For shimmer, I think I'm just gonna use this brush like I normally do. And 
for brows really quick, we're going to use my Winky Lux Brow Pencil, and this is the Brows on Point. And then we will use the Brow Gel. I was actually gifted by Winky Lux three brow pencils and a brow gel and I used one brow pencil and the gel in this video. To start the snowflake, I'm going to do it on this eye. I'm going to use a little mirror to look in. Um, I got my You Can Be planetoid palette that is my paint palette. It's three up top and four on the bottom. I always use my You Can Be planetoid palette for most of my paint looks and if I'm not using this palette I'm using their actual paints and they are very nice. You should definitely check them out. I got mine from Amazon. And then here I'm just adding four lines to each, two longer lines on the bottom and then two shorter lines at the top. And I continue this for all of the lines. So I got this e.l.f. lip oil. This is the shade Spicy Sienna. It is a red lip. Um, I'm going to attempt putting this on. I'm going to do this probably off camera and I might attempt lashes too. If I can't do the lashes, then I will just do a lot of mascara. So this is the finished look. I did get fake lashes on. I realize these ones need trimmed so the inner corner is lifting on both of them. I don't care enough right now. <laughs> I put rhinestones just on the edge of the snowflake. I'm gonna make a couple of TikToks and take this off. It was fun for my first Christmas look. I wish I could turn the lights on in this tree, but the light bulb is out currently. So I have to figure out how to change it. I hope you're excited for more Christmas content. Let me know what you want to see. I have some ideas already, but like, I would love to know like what you guys really want to see. I would love to try a morning and night routine and I have time this week that I might do that like a holiday-ish theme but I don't, I'm not too sure. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you follow along with this tag me or let me know and I'll see you in the next one.